and welcome to the session. Let's discuss the following question. The question says, from the choices given below, choose the equation whose graphs are given in figure 4.6 and figure 4.7. This is the graph given in figure 4.6 and this is the graph given in figure 4.7. For figure 4.6, first equation is y is equal to x, second is x plus y is equal to 0, third is y is equal to 2x and fourth is 2 plus 3y is equal to 7x. And for figure 4.7, first equation is y is equal to x plus 2. Second is y is equal to x minus 2. Third is y is equal to minus x plus 2. And fourth is x plus 2y is equal to 6. Before solving this question, we should know that every point... On the graph of a linear equation in two variables is a solution of the linear equation. This is the key idea in this question. Start the solution for figure 4.6 First equation is y is equal to x. We know that every point on the graph of a linear equation in two variables is a solution of the linear equation. A solution means pair of values 1 for x and 1 for y which satisfy the given equation. So in this question, we will verify whether the coordinates which are given on the line satisfy the given equation or not. If they satisfy the given equation, so this means that the graph which is given to us is the graph of that equation, otherwise it is not. The points on the line are minus one one zero zero and one minus one. Now, substitute the ordered pair 1 minus 1 in the equation y is equal to x. Right. So, by substituting x as 1 and y as minus 1, we get left hand side as minus 1 and right hand side as 1. So this implies that left hand side is not equal to right hand side. Thus, 
y is equal to x is not the required equation. given to us as x plus y is equal to 0. So let's substitute the points minus 1, 1, 0, 0 and 1, minus 1. If I substitute minus 1, 1, then we get LHS as minus 1 plus 1 and this is equal to 0. Our RHS is also equal to 0. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. Now substitute the point 0, 0. Now by substituting x as 0 and y as 0, we get LHS as 0 plus 0. So our LHS is equal to 0 and our RHS is also equal to 0. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. Right. And now substitute the point 1 minus 1. So by substituting x as 1 and y as minus 1, we get LHS as 1 minus 1. 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. Our RHS is also equal to 0. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. All the points satisfy the equation x plus y is equal to 0. So this implies that this graph is of the line x plus y is equal to 0. Thus, x plus y is equal to 0 is the required equation. given to us as y is equal to 2x. So again we will substitute the points minus 1, 1, 0, 0 and 1, minus 1 in this equation. So let's first substitute the point minus 1, 1. Now by substituting x as minus 1 and y as 1, we get LHS as 1 and RHS as minus 2. Therefore, LHS is not equal to RHS, right? And thus, Y is equal to 2X is not the required equation. And the last equation is 2 plus 3y is equal to 7x. So again we will substitute the point minus 1, 1, 0, 0 and 1, minus 1. So let's first substitute Minus 1, 1. Now here, x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 1. So now substitute these values in this equation. So by substituting the values, we get LHS as 2 plus 3 into 1 and this is equal to 5. And our RHS will be equal to 7 into minus 1. So, RHS is equal to minus 7. Therefore, LHS is not equal to RHS. Thus, 
टू प्लस थ्री वाई इज इक्वल टू सेवन एक्स इज नॉट द रिक्वायर्ड इक्वेशन For figure 4.7, first equation is y is equal to x plus 2. So we will again substitute the points minus 1, 3, 0, 2, and 2, 0 in this equation. So let's first substitute minus 1, 3. Now here x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 3. So by substituting these values, we get LHS as 3. And RHS as minus one plus two, and this implies RHS is equal to one. Therefore, LHS is not equal to RHS. So this implies that the point minus one three does not satisfy this equation, and this implies minus one three is not a solution of y is equal to x plus two. So. This graph does not represent the equation y is equal to x plus two. Thus, y is equal to x plus two is not the required equation. Second equation is y is equal to x minus two. So let's first substitute minus one three. Now here x is equal to minus one and y is equal to three. So by substituting these values, we get LHS as three and RHS as minus one minus two, and this is equal to minus three. Therefore, LHS is not equal to RHS, and this means that minus one three is not a solution of y is equal to x minus two. So this graph does not represent the equation y is equal to x minus two. Thus. Y is equal to x minus two is not the required equation. Third equation given to us is y is equal to minus x plus two. So again, we will substitute the points minus one, three, zero, two, and two, zero in this equation. So let's first substitute minus one. Three. Now here x is equal to minus one and y is equal to three. So by substituting these values, we get LHS as three and RHS as three. Right. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. Now we will substitute the point zero to Now here x is equal to zero and y is equal to two. So by substituting these values, we get LHS as two and RHS as two. Right. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. Now substitute the point two zero. Now here x is equal to two and y is equal to zero. So by substituting these values, we get LHS as zero and RHS as minus two plus two is equal to zero. Therefore, LHS is equal to RHS. Now all the points satisfy this equation. This means minus one, three, zero, two, and two, zero. Is the solution of the equation y is equal to minus x plus two? So this means that this graph 
represents the equation y is equal to minus x plus 2. Thus, y is equal to minus x plus 2 is the required equation. The last equation is x plus 2y is equal to 6. So again we will substitute all the points in this equation. So let's first substitute minus 1, 3. Now here x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 3. So by substituting these values we get LHS as minus 1 plus 2 into 3 and this is equal to 5 and our RHS is equal to 6. Therefore LHS is not equal to RHS. Thus x plus 2y is equal to 6 is not the required equation. So, for figure 4.6, x plus y is equal to 0 is the required equation and for figure 4.7 y is equal to minus x plus 2 is the required equation. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.